Hey everyone and welcome back to Crash Bandicoot Insane Trilogy. On this video, we're going to be doing the lab level and picking up the yellow gym. Okay, as usual, get all the boxes, don't die. So, this level has these exclamation mark boxes, I guess we'll call them. And if you hit this one, it opens the door. Same with this one. Got a ton of face token. Alright, we got the zappers, but it's slightly different. They shoot three things this time. Alright, um, one of these is going to control the floor uh, thing. <laughs> that was a great description. The floor gate thing. And the other one is the door. So, we'll just hit them both. You can see they both became active. Another ton of face token. This is another floor one. And this blob, just avoid him. Okay, this one's gonna control the door, but we want to make sure it times up well, so like right there is good. Break all these. Do not spin on this next group because there's TNT in there. So jump on that TNT and let that explode. Okay, and then open up the door. Extra life. And our third Tana face token. Alright, so this is slightly tricky. Um, don't break the jump crate. And you can see there's a jump crate on top too. So what we actually have to do is get on top of the top one. I'm great at describing things today. Um, so... How you want to do that is jump on the very edge of this bottom one and then sort of wrap around. But if you screw it up, you're going to break the top one and then you may as well just jump off if you do that because you can't get all the crates. So let's see here. Like that is how I like to do it. So just sort of jump through and then in midair redirect. And that is the easiest way for me. But whatever works for you, as long as you get it. All right, and that's all 12 in the bonus round. Open up that door. And this guy right here, you just need to avoid him. If he touches you, you die. So we're going to go around the left side of him. Just jump around. Hit those two. Uh, this is another floor one. Open up the door, avoid the blob. Alright, make sure I time this right. I'm gonna hit the left one first because that's the door. The door stays open a little bit longer. The floor goes away quicker. Hit that. There we go. This guy, just rush him. Rush and spin. Okay, so this part, I'm gonna get over here. And uh, activate the TNT, and then I'm going to go backwards so I don't die. So I want to time this correctly. So like right now should be good. Alright, same thing here. I need some timing about right now should be good. And around that dude. Watch out for Mr. Blob. Open up that door and through. Two more lives and here is the tricky part. We're almost to the end but they got this part. So you need to time this just about perfect. So you, that uh, floor platform thing does not last very long. So you gotta jump almost when it starts to appear quickly get through it like just a few steps just far enough so your next jump will get you to safety and the timing's a little bit difficult to get because the door doesn't stay open for very long oh shit well maybe i should have went there i'm really bad at this one i should have went there though that was perfect opportunity i'm gonna try it oh that was close but i made it Okay, pretty much home free. 
Jump on the TNT, hit that last one, and propel yourself to the end. Explosions and Yellow Gym. That was actually my first try. I've been struggling to get that Yellow Gym in practice. But first try, bam! Did it no problem. Okay, so just like the other gems, that uh, gem that we got, the yellow gem, will let us get the clear gems that we couldn't in some previous levels. And it'll also allow us to get the purple gem, which will then open up some other levels we can get the clear gem. So that's what we'll be doing in the next few videos. So, thank you for watching, and I will see you next time.